the 2014 edition of Bravecast. Um, covering the entertainment of Bremen High School. We have a problem. Let's get started with our new story. Let's get started with our first story. Xfinity has created a way for customers to watch their favorite shows whenever they want. They now have Xfinity Internet offered at no additional cost, allowing customers to have Wi-Fi access wherever it's available. Vice President of Business Development says that Wi-Fi is an important part of our strategy to be placed where customers can connect all devices anywhere at any time. Speaking of offers, Robert Morris University is now offering its students a special kind of athletic scholarship. The school is providing 35 students with First in America video game scholarships for playing League of Legends in the university's eSports club. Students are awarded $15,000 a year with hopes that the club will make it to compete against other universities from around the world at the Seoul Korea Stadium. The scholarship was originally thought up by Kurt Melker while he was searching online for video games. Well, I feel that that's playing. a great opportunity for the students and the, the people that are out there um, devoting their lives to video games and the development of those video games because they um, not only play them, but some of them actually want to be part of creating most of these video games. So that the scholarship is given to them is a pretty good opportunity for them to pursue their um, their goal in life. Xbox One was launched last November. Microsoft has recently found a way to improve their services. They have created a website for consumers to give feedback on the console games and new ideas. With the website, consumers can now have an area where they can comment and share ideas among each other for Microsoft to look at and maybe take in consideration. The lovable minions are back. A new trailer has emerged showing the yellow creatures from Despicable Me and Despicable Me 2 getting into even more mishap as they encounter dinosaurs, Napoleon, and Dracula, eventually ending them in 1968 New York. Directed by Pierre Coffin and written by Brian Lynch, the Despicable Me spinoff is set to be in theaters by July of 2015. For all the Toy Story fans, be prepared for the new film. John Lasseter, the original director for 1995 and 1999 sequel, is now helping with the new Toy Story. Lasseter decided to collaborate with Andrew Stanton, Pete Docter, and League Unrich. Toy Story 4 will be coming to the big screen in June 20 of 2014. 2017, sorry. The Disney princesses are taking over children's clothing markets. Anna and Elsa dresses, based off the outfits from Disney's Frozen characters, are being sold all over North America. So far, Disney consumer products have sold over 3 million dresses with an anticipated rise during the holiday season. The dresses range from $50 to $100 at Disney stores. Disney Frozen was a great success. Frozen is now going global with live performances from Elsa, the Snow Queen of Andredale, her sister Anna, and some of the favorite characters from the film. Be prepared this spring, UK. On the subject of music, Taylor Swift has had the largest sales week since 2002. The country-turned-pop artist has sold almost 1.3 million copies of her album, entitled 1989, in its debut week, sales that haven't been reached since Eminem's The Eminem Show debut in June of 2002. Taylor Swift has deemed the first artist to go platinum in 2014. Lovers, listen up. Just from the beginning of 2014, there has been a high demand for Netflix accounts. However, 10,000 accounts were stolen, adding up to $20,000 gone. The company is now currently trying to figure out a way to keep, up, keep users' accounts safe. Surprise! Billboard has released details on Beyonce Knowles' new album. The album, which comes within a box set, is entitled More and contains six new Beyonce songs, two of which are never before heard, the other four being remixes of these previous singles. The box set also includes one DVD from HBO's Beyonce X10 series, and another that features 17 Beyonce music videos. I spoke with Rachel to see what she had to say. I didn't know her new album was coming out. She's so good. I wondered when it's dropping. I'm so excited for it. Well, that's all we have this month. Make sure you check us out online at www.bdtv.net. And subscribe to our YouTube channel by searching Bremen District Television. Finally, don't forget to like us on Facebook. For Stefan, I'm Ifua. We'll see you next month.